do it. Georgia, how do you do it? <laughs> um, I think my style is pretty casual, though it depends on my mood. Like some days I'd want to wear like skinny jeans and heels, other days like just Uggs and tracksuit or whatever, but it's usually quite casual. Yeah, and you yeah. absolutely love clothes. I mean, yeah. Clothes are a big part of your yeah, life. Yeah, I love clothes. I'm a shopaholic. Like, I'll go into town and I'll buy something nearly every day. I'm, like, obsessive. <laughs> now, I believe this is your wardrobe. Yeah. And I have to say, I don't know whether I'm stunned or more envious. And, yeah. oh, it's, it's, so it's a shrine to clothes. It's, um, <laughs> it's, it's a shrine to me being a neat freak. But, like, I just, everything, it's just, I always have to have everything perfect. I'm a bit weird like that. No, that's not weird. It's fabulous. <laughs> <laughs> I believe the wag look is a big no-no for you. Yeah, I'm just not really into to that kind of, you know, that kind of very overdone, yeah, like hair extensions, tan, little dresses. It just wouldn't be my style, yeah. really. Yeah. Really and we've got a shot of Alex Curran there, uh, wife of footballer Stephen Gerrard. I think she looks like a quality street rapper, to <laughs> coin a phrase that's been used <laughs> recently. It's just too yeah, much. Yeah, it would, just wouldn't be my thing. I just think it's a bit overdone now, just that whole look. So I think, like, less is more yeah. sometimes. <laughs> Another pet hate of yours, I believe, the London look, that very edgy, yeah, uber cool look. Just like look. uber, very very trendy trying too hard yeah yes yeah, so <laughs> agnes dane there yeah i think she's I, I think she's nice but i just like that kind of you know that kind of look where everyone's with the quiff and the fake glasses and all that kind of stuff yeah. i think it's a bit much do you think it's, it's a look that's very hard to get away with because you could look a little bit more fashion victim than fashion yeah forward. sometimes yeah i yeah. think so definitely yeah so we steer clear of that one mm. keep it simple simple i think seems yeah. to be yes yeah. one of your now, as a child, were you into fashion at all? I mean, did you look to your mum and admire the clothes uh, she wore? Or yeah, is it like, something? my whole family's very arty. My mum's an artist, and my grandmother would always make clothes and everything, so my family are just very into fashion, and my mum is a shopaholic as well, so yeah. I get it from her. Yeah, and um, speaking of being a shopaholic, I mean, obviously all shopaholics have some fabulous bargains that they've acquired over the years. You've brought along a couple yeah, of examples. Few bargains, so yeah. we'll just talk through these here, and uh, these fabulous boots. Yeah, they're great. I got, a treat. I got them for like 10 euro in shoe rack and they're amazing. They're, they're very similar to the ones in Topshop which are like 150, I have them as well. But um, <laughs> these are great, like you can just wear them every day, give you like 10 inches, make you 10 inches taller. But they're great. They certainly yeah. would. Would you actually wear those during the day or is that a I'd night time only? Night time and they're good for work as well. They're good like for looking a bit taller. And yeah. Stuff. They're great. And you're, you're tall enough. <laughs> yeah. And what about these gorgeous shoes in the middle? Um, I got those new shoes in Brown Thomas on the sale. And I think they were about 500 and I got them for 120, 120. So, okay, good yeah. bargain. Yeah, really good bargain. Yeah. Let's, have, let's have a little examination. Again, with the, the, the platforms. They're super high as well. The, I mean, that must be at least six inches. Is think, it properly? Yeah, or? I'd say. They're yeah. a bit difficult to walk in now, but I still really like them. Oh, they're car to bar shoes, yeah. as, 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 as I'm told. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I don't possess any. And what about the fabulous um, glitzy red pair over here? I got here. these um, Valentino shoes in a vintage shop in LA. and. I think it's like a designer vintage shop and I think they were like about $20 or something like that. Yeah. So there I was delighted when I found them. And uh, I just have to ask you about these jeans these because the this, there was mention of yeah. these already. They look so tight. Look at how <laughs> tiny they are. <laughs> oh my goodness. They're the best jeans ever. These are salsa jeans? The salsa no. jeans. Explain. They give you like an automatic bum because like I'm always real conscious of my bum. I'd always like to have like a big bum. I'd love that. And these make you look like you've not a big bum. They make your bum yeah. like they lift it up and make it look like really round. They're just the best. Well, I don't know a woman who wouldn't appreciate <laughs> a little brilliant. bum lift in yeah. her jeans. Yeah. <laughs> Gorgeous. <laughs> now, of course, they're fabulous and you did very well there. <laughs> but every fashionista has made her shopping mistakes over the years. So I've made a few. A yeah. yeah. Definitely. <laughs> Are we going to see? It's All awful. right. This is what you consider one of your mistakes. I don't think any man in the country would think that was a mistake but you don't like it. I think it's <laughs> awful yeah it's so bad. I why, don't know what I was thinking that night. Why, why is it so awful to you? It's just the top and the jeans and the shoes. I, I honestly do not know what I was thinking. And that wasn't very long ago either so I can't blame it on age. <laughs> it was just terrible. And that's it. That's the only one, though. That's the only oh, no. one we have. There's definitely you. There's a few. I've hid the rest. Really? What, okay, describe <laughs> what else? What other sort of things did you go wrong with? Um, I don't know. Like I think some, I think when I was younger, I suppose, like going through different phases of dress and everything. I wore those big baggy, you know, those big baggy jeans yeah. and everything. I've gone through a lot of different phases of clothes and stuff. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, what about wish list for this season? You know, the current trends that are out there, uh, and you can even go sky sky, sky high. You know, designer mm -hmm. wishes. What would you like? I really want a pair of. Um, over the knee Alexander McQueen boots. So I think I might have to. Oh, right. Actually, we, we have a shot of there. This is Naomi yeah. now at Mr. McQueen's funeral, indeed. Um, um, again, skyscrapers. Yeah. <laughs> 
I love skyscrapers. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, they are beautiful. Yeah. But really, would powerful. you get your wear out of them? I'm going to sound like a mammy now. <laughs> I know, yeah. There's not many places. You can maybe on a night out or something. They'd be good. Yeah. What about um, design? You've been working in fashion for quite some time. Yeah. You must have a few designers that you mm. particularly favour. I love um, Yves Saint Laurent. I love um, Burberry, Presume, Zach Pose, and Philip Lim. Loads of designers. Yeah. Yeah. And do you get to indulge very often? Um, like I, I would mostly shop on the high street. I love Zara, I love All Saints, I love pennies as well. But like maybe once every few months I'll buy myself, treat myself and buy myself something nice. Yeah. And I believe you, you have a bit of a little penchant for designer handbags, yeah. right? How <laughs> yeah. many of them do you have? I have loads. I have a handbag collection. This came from my mom too. I got one nice handbag from her and now, I've, <laughs> and now I just keep on getting them. So it's all your mum's yeah, fault. She started yeah. this. Okay. What would be your absolute favourite, favourite, favourite thing of in all of your wardrobe? Um, I love my All Saints black leather jacket because you can just wear it with everything. It just mm -hmm. goes with it. Like you can throw it on with like a little dress or jeans or anything. So that would probably be my favourite thing in my yeah. wardrobe. And the worst thing you ever bought? Um, worst thing. The worst thing I ever bought was this leopard print dress and I've no idea why I bought it. I just came home yeah. with it and I tried it on. I was like, why did I get What was that? I thinking? I know. Yeah, I always think, I know leopard's back with a bang this season. Yeah. Tread carefully. Yeah. Everyone out there, tread carefully. <laughs> Georgia, that's great. Thank, Thank you. you so much Thank for coming you. in. Cheers. No problem. Now, it's competition.